Hey everybody, welcome to Mike and May's Great Adventure. We're about an hour and about an hour and five minutes from stopping for the day. We are in west, western Texas, southwestern Texas, and we're coming up to the I-20 split. Hey, he's only seen I-20 coming across here. So this is not the way that we're used before? Nope. As really? A, right now, if if you look out your right where window... We, where the way we used before? Not that way. Miles. To the left there. If you look out your right window, honey, you've never seen that before. Now you've seen it. Everything you see across here is brand new to you. Oh, it's not. It looks like it's getting rain. I don't know. The cloud is beautiful. Yeah, it's kind of a pretty... Happy Father's Day, guys, to all fathers out there. Yeah. May is making me a steak dinner. Yeah. With mushroom, green beans, and garlic on the side, and of course, rice. Yeah, of course. Because she, she knows how much I want the rice. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to have you the have rice. You have only one scoop of rice, honey. Yeah, that's right. And then the two scoops is mine. Two scoops? Yeah. You mean uh, the whole rest of the what's in the <laughs> rice pot? <laughs> two very, 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 very big scoops. <laughs> My scoops with a spoon. It mazes with... Okay. Next time when we come back, we buy the like a scoop of uh, like a what call that? A scooper. Yes, yeah, scooper. Yeah. So because we are on diet, so we need to scoop our rice. Yeah, like an ice cream scooper. Uh huh. Well, I could easily stick to that, but I don't think you can. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe I eat a lot today, but tomorrow I'm diet again. Right there, honey. San Antonio, 381 miles. Oh, we're not going to make that. No, tomorrow we'll have about 310 miles to drive. I think. Let me look on This our... is the part of uh, Texas, guy, the, the beautiful. There's a Rocky Mountain. I love Texas. I told me I don't... I don't know what it is about Texas. I just love it. I always have. Continue on this road for 374 miles. Yes, yeah, so we're going to have six hours, five and a half to six hours to get there tomorrow. By the way, guys, we go to the grocery in yeah. the, uh, close to the border of Mexico, right, honey? Yes. And then there's a visible and also the you know the meat and I found the uh, we, we found the cactus over there in the grocery yeah so the meat people eat it just like that cactus over here like a black cactus yeah it's the ones that looks like pancakes yeah I, I have no idea what it tastes like in my mind well because I saw the woman the Thai, the Thailand woman look at that view huh uh, she eat the cactus, and then the first time I saw that, oh, the cactus is a food. Oh, Look at that view! That. Wow, beautiful view. Um, I, in my mind, I picture. I think it's yummy. I picture it in my mind. It tastes like a bitter cucumber. So, if you guys knows about that. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if that's what it tastes like, but just for some reason. In my mind, I think it it tastes like that. I never heard that from anybody, so I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either. But uh, yeah, but this yeah, I saw that in the one video in Facebook that the girl eaten eat the cactus. Yeah. Oh my goodness! That was, uh, the, the that was a that was a Native American truck stop that we stopped at. But it was a nice surprise because the fuel was cheap, 205 a gallon for out there. That's 50 cents a gallon cheaper than everyone else. Uh -huh. And then when I went 
had to give up my card to turn the pump on. I saw a whole grocery store, so I got done pumping the fuel and pull forward. I told Meg, come on, we're going to go in the grocery shop. We got... Um, I don't know that I've ever eaten chuck steak or not. It's beef, so it'll do. They didn't have sirloin, or they didn't have New York I think this strip. Is good. I think this is good. It looks good, but it was. Uh, we tried the plate. It's a little <laughs> over, a little over two pounds. It was twelve dollars and four cents. And then we got, I uh, got a pack of pork chops. There's six pork chops in there. Sick. I mean, big pork chops. Uh, that was. I think four dollars and ninety nine cents, and then I got a couple packs of boneless pork ribs. May loves to use that for like uh, adobo. adobo stuff like that, and that was like a dollar seventy nine a pack. Um, the chicken, it's uh, five chicken legs in a pack, and they're the Purdue. They're I mean, they're almost like a turkey leg. They're that big. Got two packs of that. They were a buck seventy-nine a pack. They got vegetables. I found she's out of jalapenos, the pickled jalapenos. I got her those. Uh, I don't know, a bunch of stuff. It all came to like sixty dollars. I mean, just that meat alone in a regular store is going to be $60 or more. So we're pretty happy. We yeah. we were down to... What because we our, our meat honey in there, inside the freezer, is only one, uh, two pork chops left. Two pork chops. Yeah. That's what we were down to. So now we're fully stocked. Um, I didn't go crazy because we're going to be going home in 11 days. So Yeah, we're going home. I'm excited. We, we should yeah, have enough. see our garden over there. Yeah. I think that vegetable when we get home. Some of it we'll be able to pick and we'll be able yeah. to bring with us when we come back out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that should do us. That'll, that'll hold us pretty well. Uh, we always grab a pack of hot dogs. I know that's not good for you, but <coughs> sometimes that's our... Like a afternoon stack, stack yeah, on a day like hungry. today where we're just driving and not stopping. Uh, one hot dog ain't gonna kill you every few days. So we'll just, May doesn't even put hers in bread. She just uh, scoops a little rice on there, chops her hot dog up, yep. eats it with the rice. I'm a bread guy, I gotta have my bread. Which isn't good for you, but Almost everything in the world's not good for you in one yes, way or another. In it, I am a rice girl. And so, the way we've been going about this is moderation. We just don't stuff our face till our eyes are bugging out. And as time's going by, you eat less because your stomach feels full. You know, when you, when you don't fill it to a stretching point every time. 